Welcome. In front of me is a Otis Thanos 10 and today I'll show you how you can hard reset this tablet through recovery mode. Now this process also removes things like screen lock, so if you have one that you don't know for some reason, you can get rid of it this way. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna quickly lock the device and you can see that I do have a pattern set right here and I'll progress from the lock screen as though I don't know it. So let's hold the power key select power off and once the tablet turns off you want to hold power key and volume up at the same time so those two keys i'm gonna wait for this to disappear first and additionally you can also see that uh, i am charging the device but the cable is not required so okay now that the screen is completely off power key volume up Let me quickly check something. Yep, I was uh, making sure that this is volume up and it is. So anyway, uh, once you see uh, the boot mode right here, you have your first option selected, which is recovery mode. If it's not, because uh, it's sometimes when you let go of the two keys, it accepts it as a input and it scrolls down. So you will just use volume up again to cycle through the options. Make sure that the first one is selected and then press volume down to confirm it. Obviously, this will boot us into recovery mode. From where, uh, using again volume up and down, uh, you will want to select, quickly flip it, uh, wipe data factor reset. Now, as you will probably realize, uh, this is upside down. And you might think that doesn't really matter, but a volume, uh, usually volume up goes up, right? So volume up in this mode is actually flipped around. It should be the same way, you know. So anyway, uh, in here, want to select uh, wipe, uh, wipe data factor reset, then confirm it with power key, select yes. At the bottom, you will see data uh, wiping data and then data wipe complete. There we go. At which point reboot system now will be selected by default. So press power key once again to initiate that reboot. So this will now continue the process in the background. It will take a little bit longer for the device to boot back up, but once the factory reset has been finished, we will be presented with Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is visible. And as you can see, the process is now finished and you can set up your device however you like. So, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.